Uh, Senator Manchin yesterday made it clear he was not going to support getting rid of the legislative filibuster under any circumstances for the duration of this Congress. I talked to Senator Sinema last night. She said the same thing. So the issue, as far as I'm concerned, is resolved. Uh, it was unfortunate that uh, Senate Democrats, uh, Leader Schumer, had a different point of view when it came to the filibuster. And I'm grateful, as the leader pointed out, to Senators Manchin and Sinema for their willingness to step forward and say that we will protect the legislative filibuster. I think having that on the record uh, pretty much ensures that, at least for the foreseeable future, we'll be able to maintain the 60 vote threshold when it comes to most legislation and ensure that minority uh, voices and votes are represented in the United States Senate. President Biden gave his inaugural address <clears throat> and he called for unity. So we have a 50-50 Senate. <clears throat> that is not a Senate that should pursue radical ideas. But yet Chuck Schumer in his statements and speeches is one that is refusing to go and do what should be done in terms of committing to focus on a Senate that can work together. So that is the only, was the only impediment to moving ahead. Senator Schumer and I'll be able to adopt a, an organizing resolution that's very close to exactly what was negotiated by Lott and Daschle after the 2000 election when we also ended up with a 50-50 Senate.